It's Pretzel Etzel here, and today I'm going to show you guys my top three house purchases in Toka Life World. This is just my opinion on which one I think would be the best purchases, and I'm doing my top three. Uh, let's get started. So, here's how Toka Life World works in the app. You have free places and then you have add-ons that you can buy called like purchase packs basically. This is free Bop City and it's all the way right here. Bop City has hair salon, storage facility, food place, uh, it has the mail center, apartment theater, tailor shop, a pet store, grocery area, electronic store, and that's Bop City and it's free. And then you have other places like the Busy Plaza, which has upgrades that you can purchase, like the mall, fancy restaurant, hospital, OK Street, on the Islands. These are all different places that you can purchase, right? Now, the difference is that all these other places are areas that are like businesses, basically, mostly, for the most part, right? And then you have this other area where they call it Home Designer, and it's pretty much a neighborhood where you can build your own house that you actually get to decorate yourself. So to build your own house there, you have to purchase one of the house packs, and that's what I'm gonna talk about today. I'm gonna tell you the top three of those house packs and which ones I would recommend getting if you could only choose from a few. So we're over here in the shop, right? Let's go look at best sellers. What's crazy about best sellers, this is where they tell you which packs people buy the most. And the funny thing is that the ones that are on this list are the one, some of the ones I'm about to show you guys and talk about. They've got Vacation Pool Villa, Modern Mansion and Neon Rainbow Apartment. The reason why I see check marks all across here is because I bought everything in the app, all the packs, all the places, and yeah, I've been playing it for months, so I just figured why not? Let's get started. We're gonna go into town, into the neighborhood, right here. And as you guys can see, I have the houses built again. And let's start with number three on the list. Number three of the houses that I think you should purchase, if you only could choose a few, is the House Pool Villa. This is what the inside of it looks like. The reason why I like this one as number three is because it has some pretty good layouts for the rooms and it has this pool plus this backyard cabana area which I think is really cool because not all of the houses have pools so it, the reason why it's not number two or number one on the list is because it doesn't have a lot of space inside to decorate if you have a big family so that's why it's not number one now if you get this house it comes with a couple things that I'm going to show you guys I have to go back to the shop to show you usually the house purchases come with like wallpapers and accessories and furniture so let me show you guys. Let's click it. It comes with the dreamy villa with a private pool, which is what I just showed you guys. 39 pieces of summer furniture, 51 beautiful decorations, five wall designs, which is like a wallpapers, and then six floor patterns. And this is what they all look like here. And then these are the wallpapers. And then here's some pictures of what it looks like once people have just decorated theirs. Oh, this is creative. This person actually put their bed outside. That's another way to maximize space. But yeah, this is number three on the list. Let's go on over to number two. Number two that I think, you know, a person would want if they can only choose a few is the Modern Mansion. Okay. So the modern mansion has two floors. It's a really big house. So a lot of people that like to do millionaire role plays or just big family role plays in general, they love getting the modern mansion. So you get 76 pieces of furniture, 49 decorations, seven wallpapers, and then seven floor patterns. And let me show you a picture of all the uh, furniture that you get. And then let's go over to, well, this is the furniture and then the accessories. And then let's go on over to the different 
wallpaper no this looks like floor papers and wallpapers yeah this is both floor paper and wallpapers and then here's some pictures of people having it designed now i have this one so i'm gonna go and show you guys what it looks like it with my character in it and just walk around and then I'll tell you why I think it's number two on the list. So first, I think it's number two and not number one or three because it has a lot of space. If you have a big family, you'll really love this place. It has so much room for all of them. It also has an elevator. It even has this front door area that you can also decorate, which I really, really love. So yeah, that's why I think it's better than the pool villa house. And then you also have an outdoor pool that's on the second floor. So it's like a penthouse pool. This is second floor. You also have other rooms like the kitchen. Well, you don't have to make it the kitchen, but another room, another room, another room. So as you can see, this is perfect for a huge family. Now, the reason why I don't think that this is number one to get is because the wallpapers and floor patterns, they're cute, but my style is more kawaii and colorful and you don't get those kinds of furniture, accessories or wallpapers with this one so it's number two for me not number one even though it's very very huge let's go on over to number one you guys probably already guessed what it is based on my style that i mentioned but i'm going to show you anyway okay guys number one is the neon rainbow apartment oh my goodness not only is it cute on the outside, but look at the furniture and decorations that you get, plus the wall patterns, man. Look at all this furniture. How cute is that? Pink, purples, kawaii stuff, colorful stuff, neon stuff, pastel stuff. It's just so adorable. Look at the wallpapers and the floors. How cute is that? Rainbow stuff, hearts, cute checker patterns. This is what it looks like when people have decorated theirs. And then let me go on into the house. So it's number one, guys, because if you like colorful things, it comes with all these colorful things that you can not only use in this house, but by purchasing the house pack, you can also use it in any other house. So if I wanted to decorate my, my mansion with this kawaii colorful theme, I can now because I have the wallpapers. So this is what the house looks like. It also has a, it has a good amount of space. This is, has more space than the house pool villa, but less space than the mansion. But overall, I think it's better than both of them. So that's why this is my number one. Let me show you how you did some wallpapers. So like, because I have all the packs, you can see all your wallpapers here, but the ones that come with this are ones like this. Oh, so beautiful. This one, love it. This one and the furniture man and accessories are beyond cute. Let me show you this. Which one do I want to pull out? Hmm. It's really hard to choose. Uh, let's go with, okay, I'm gonna look for the neon signs. So we're gonna go back over here. Pretty sure the neons are under lights. Yep, look at this, a disco ball. Rainbow neon light heart beautiful cloud oh actually threw that away boom <laughs> beautiful clouds it's just so so cute oh let's put a floor paper down floor pattern down that's from the neon apartment collection which is this okay guys so yeah this is the number one house that i think you should get if you can only get one or two houses in Toka Life World. This is the best one in my opinion. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Which one is your favorite? And do you disagree with this video? Is there a different house pack that you think is better than this one? Let me know. Thank you for watching my channel. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so. Pretzel et so.